Okay, yeah. let's go. <laughs> Get it on. <laughs> Hi, my name is Amelia. Welcome to the Produce Made Simple Kitchen, your go-to resource for everything fruit and veg. Today we're going to do a sweet take on our traditional strata, using fresh, local, Ontario tender fruit. You want to start off by using some day-old bread and cutting it up into some rough cubes. It's a little rougher than I wanted. <laughs> but next, we're going to place it into a well-oiled baking pan. Next, we're going to lightly whisk together five eggs and mix in a cup and a half of milk. Next, we're gonna take our egg mixture and pour it over our bread. For this recipe, we're gonna be using one peach, one apricot, and a quarter cup of pitted tart cherries. After we've cut our fruit, roughly diced it, we're gonna place it into our mixture. You wanna be sure to sprinkle it evenly so that every piece gets a really good mouthful of fruit. You can use a spoon just to kind of press it in. And we're gonna add our quarter cup of tart pitted cherries. And there you have it. And now for the finishing touch, you wanna sprinkle on some cinnamon. If you're serving a large group for Sunday brunch, let's say, we suggest that you cover it with some uh, plastic saran wrap and stick it in the fridge overnight. However, if you're short on time or if you forgot, or we suggest that you stick it in the fridge for at least an hour and then put it in the oven at 350 degrees for about 45 minutes. Everyone's oven is a little bit different. You'll know the strata is ready when the egg mixture in the middle is set. Depending on how hungry you are, this will serve anywhere from four to six people. Oh, this looks delicious. Place it in our plate. And we're fancy, so we're gonna drizzle on some of the syrup. And now for the best part, we get to try it. So delicious. For more recipes like this, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next time. Like, comment, you have a sparkle. <laughs> Right there. <laughs> Where did the sparkle come from? Knitted sour cherry. And just, do I say like, I don't say anything about putting them in. I'm just gonna put them in. I'm not gonna say anything about it. What do you mean? Like, <laughs> when I'm done cutting them, <laughs> whisk it all together and pour it over of our um, cubed bread. Our bread. <laughs> Comment and subscribe. And be sure to join us next time for a lot more. Good. Good. The food in the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>